Let's right, jump into our cosmic queries, and of course, we always start off with a Patreon patron question. And if you support us on Patreon, uh, we will give your questions priority here at Cosmic Queries. Okay, cool. Patreon. Okay, where we basically buy your loyalty. <laughs> <laughs> okay, here we go. Matthew uh, Massanon from Calgary, Alberta mm -hmm. says, in your opinion, Dr. Tyson, what was the most significant thing that the Apollo program achieved with the exception of landing on the moon? Wow, that's a, that's a good question when you think about it, because everybody, you say Apollo program, it's moon landing. Bang. That's the end of it. That's it. But he's saying, give me something that is just as significant that we don't think about. Tang. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. <laughs> uh, so, um, <laughs> beginning in 1970, uh -huh. a little earlier, but in 1970 was the first Earth Day uh, nationally, and then it became a rapid international hit, if you will. Yeah, because Earth Day is global now. It's global now, and it's a significant global celebration yeah. of our home planet. And around that same time, so 19, whatever, what else happened? 1971, two, and three, we would see the passing of the Comprehensive Clean Air Act, Clean Water Act. Uh, in 1970, NOAA was founded, the National Oceanic and Atmospheric Administration, to monitor our climate and our oceans and our weather. And not only that, the Environmental Protection Agency was founded in 1970. By the time 1970 three came around uh, leaded gas would be banned D -D uh, yeah leaded gas would be banned right. DDT would be banned the catalytic converter would be introduced That's right all of this happened during the years we were going to the moon at a time when we had a whole lot of other stuff distracting us like a cold war with the Soviet Union and a hot war in Southeast Asia and campus unrest from anti-war uh, protests and the civil rights movement and assassinations. 1968 would see two assassinations um, it, on, on domestic soil. And so, so why am I saying all this? Because while we had all these other potential distractions, we nonetheless paused to reflect on our relationship to our home planet. So I submit to you that though we went to the moon right. to explore the moon, upon getting there and looking back, in fact, we would discover Earth for the first time. Wow, so it's like I've been to paradise, but I've never been to me. <laughs> <laughs> yes, it's exactly that. Yeah, exactly, right. <laughs> so, uh, can you put a dollar figure right. on the fact that seeing Earth in the sky from the moon was like a firmware update in our sense of awareness and who we are of and, the importance of Earth and our relationship to it? Right. Uh, okay, that's that's actually uh, that's a bit more existential than I was expecting for an answer. Okay, I have to say that's a damn good answer because it's more of um, the the it, it's more of a, a collective conscious enlightenment. Yes, and I don't think anyone started the program with that expectation. Right, but that is clearly a consequence of it. Right, and so. Um, and remember that TV commercial with the Native American standing on the on the uh, and it was a tear in his single eye. Single tear. The single it's, tear right. went and people throwing garbage out the window. Right. That didn't happen until this period, until we were going to the moon. We we were total garbage out the window people for long before that, right? <laughs> <laughs> no, I never got that about us. I mean, seriously, garbage out the window, uh, pretty much all through human history. All through human history, yeah. and in fact, that was great for anthropologists. They can find stuff along the Roman Via, right? You know that people, oh, a McDonald's cup. <laughs> what did they do? <laughs> Boy, McDonald's would have been around. <laughs> no, but you, you, it was. We didn't start thinking of it as a. As a as a cultural environmental problem until that that period. Wow. Yeah. Okay. Wow. That's hey hey Matthew. I uh, you know I hope you're satisfied with that answer because it was a, a completely uh, curve complete curveball with that answer. And then there's Tang. <laughs> <laughs> that and Tang a close second. Tang, very close second. There you go. <laughs>